Welcome to the Leicester How To channel. Today we will explain how to operate the Weldplast 600 and 605 extruder along with some tips and tricks. The Weldplast is packed in a carrying case along with a welding shoe. The 605 comes with the guide handle, which can be mounted easily on the raster element on the right side. Connect the plug to power supply. Switch on the device. Check the voltage. Press the menu button and choose the recipe you want. Start the warm-up by pressing the heat button. The LED work light will come on when it's ready to weld. Based on the thickness of the material to be welded and the required wall geometry, select the correct welding shoe. Remove the welding shoe while the machine is still at operating temperature. Clean the nozzle with a soft brass brush. When attaching the welding shoe, lock it in by tightening the set screws with a 3mm Allen wrench. Adjust the preheat nozzle close to the base material and centric to the welding shoe. To prevent the tool from cooling out, the insulating sleeve can be pulled over. The heat reflector warms up the gliding surface of the welding shoe. This allows a smooth surface of the weld seam to be achieved. Switch on the drive. Insert the welding rod on either side, not both. If necessary for capturing moisture and dust a cleaning cloth can be clamped to the welding rod and in front of the intake keeping the intake area clean. The recommended processing temperatures are available from the material manufacturer. The plast and the air temperature are closed loop controlled. Nevertheless check the temperatures occasionally. Measure the air temperature 5 mm in the preheating nozzle. The plast can be manually measured with the thermometer probe at a 10 mm depth inside the welding shoe. When welding, the weld plast should be moved forward at a constant speed and pressure along the area to be welded. Before switching off, the welding shoe must be purged. To do this, cut a piece of welding rod with a pair of pliers. For a few seconds then pull on the welding rod to remove the plastic plug from inside the shoe. Switch off the heating, and let the machine cool down automatically. Clean the weldplast daily from coarse dirt, clean the air filters and check the power cord. Thank you for using the Leister Weldplast 600-605.